Hey guys, Alex here from uh, Rising Sun Customs. Uh, just finished up putting on the linkage to the jockey shift on the GS450. Um, I want to show you what I use to do that. And uh, I don't know if I've showed you, you guys this before, but this is my Smithy all-in-one uh, milling, lathe, and drilling machine. Uh, this thing, let me tell you, uh, if any of you guys out there are thinking, or girls, <laughs> are thinking of uh, making custom bikes, buy one of these machines because it is so versatile. Uh, like I said, it's a three-in-one, so it's got the you know the uh, lathe part here, this uh, this uh, chuck, this lathe chuck here. Uh, the three-jaw chuck is is great for for lathing. Um, this is the milling part of it. A milling, uh, a mill, a mill end uh, on there on the machine that I have right now, and that's what I use to make the. Uh, that's what I use to cut out this uh, shifter handle to fit the linkage to fit the linkage uh, uh, end, the end link for the shift link. As you can see, it's all done. It's all done, mocked up basically. So you know it'll work. It'll work nicely. Um, I got to change this mount here, this aluminum mount. This has got to, this has got to be changed out for a steel one because, as you can see, it's a little bit flimsy. <laughs> so that's got to be changed out. But besides that, everything works good. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with the results, the way they came out, and this thing just looks really cool on here. So I got to get a different uh, tap handle or something for this because this is this is all messed up. So anyway, um, <clears throat> yeah, so. Uh, but I just wanted to show you guys the milling machine. That's the main thing I wanted to show you. Again, if you're thinking of doing any custom bike work, whether it's Harleys, metric bikes, Jap bikes, whatever, buy one of these machines because it is well, well worth it. And I was fortunate enough to find this machine used for about 600 bucks. But again, well worth the money. One of the best purchases I ever made. You can make your own parts. Uh, if you want spec, uh, specific uh, spec measurement parts, you can make them yourself. You don't have to wait to have them made, you know, uh, making them yourself is way cheaper. Trust me, this thing just, uh, is, <laughs> this thing is, this thing's awesome. That's all I'm going to say. This thing is just, uh, freaking awesome. So again, if you think about getting one, just buy one. Anyway, um, that's about it. Just wanted to show you that. And of course the progress on the bike and the GS450, it's getting there. Sh uh, shift link is done for the jockey shift pretty much. Next, I think I'm going to uh, take out the motor and uh, do a little bit more welding and grinding on the frame and get the frame out to powder coat soon. Uh, the tank is going to be dented in on the sides and then I'm also going to get this dent on the top here fixed. Um, yeah, so progress being made. It's coming along. Anyway, uh, you guys have a good night. Of course, remember to always keep the sticky side down. Please like, subscribe, and share here on the YouTube channel for Rising Sun Customs. And you guys have yourself a good evening. Take care. Bye-bye.